In a bustling meadow far away, where wildflowers danced in vibrant hues and the sun sang a cheerful tune, there lived a mischievous yet lovable group of animals. There was Hoppy the rabbit, with his long floppy ears and a spring in his step. His best friend was Flicker the fox, a sly and cunning creature with a twinkle in her eyes. Joining them were Blossom the bunny, a sweet and gentle soul with a fluffy white tail, and Whiskers the cat, a curious and playful feline with a soft purr. One sunny Easter morning, as the animals awoke from their slumber, they noticed something peculiar. Scattered across the meadow were beautiful brightly colored eggs, adorned with intricate patterns and designs. Excitement filled the air as the animals realized it was Easter. Hooray! exclaimed Hoppy, his heart pounding with delight. We must find all the Easter eggs, and so the animals embarked on a grand Easter egg hunt. Hoppy hopped nimbly through the tall grass, his keen eyesight spotting hidden eggs behind flowers and under leaves. Flicker darted and weaved through the bushes, her clever mind solving riddles and puzzles that led her to secret sashes. Blossom, with her gentle touch, carefully lifted eggs from their hiding places, marveling at their delicate beauty. Whiskers, using his feline agility, scaled trees and leaped over fences in search of the elusive eggs. As the animals searched, they couldn't help but notice a peculiar sight. A large white rabbit appeared from the edge of the forest, its eyes sparkling with mischief. Hello little friends, said the white rabbit in a booming voice. I am known as Harvey the Easter Bunny, and I have a special surprise for you. With a flick of his paw, Harvey summoned a massive basket filled with even more Easter eggs. The animals gasped in amazement and cheered with joy. For you see, said Harvey, I have chosen you to be my helpers in delivering these Easter eggs to all the good children in the world. The animals were thrilled. They had never imagined anything so wonderful. They quickly gathered around Harvey and loaded the basket onto Hoppy's back. Off we go, exclaimed Hoppy, his excitement bubbling over. And so the animals set off on their mission, Hoppy leading the way, followed by Flicker, Blossom, and Whiskers. They traveled through forests and fields, over hills and valleys, spreading joy and laughter wherever they went. Children squealed with delight as they received their Easter eggs from the animals. They hugged Hoppy tightly, thanked Flicker for her cleverness, marveled at Blossom's gentleness, and tickled Whiskers with their laughter. As the sun began to set, the animals made their way back to the meadow, their hearts filled with a sense of accomplishment. They had delivered all the Easter eggs, and had spread happiness to children everywhere. What a wonderful day it has been, said Flicker, stretching her weary paws. Yes, agreed Hoppy, and all thanks to Harvey the Easter Bunny. And so the animals settled down for a well-deserved rest, their bodies exhausted, but their spirits soaring. They had made this Easter one to remember, and they would cherish the memories for years to come.